Min module assessment task, module four. One, Jasmine and Roland each use unit square tiles to tile a piece of paper. Their work is shown below. A, can one of the arrays be used to correctly measure the area of a piece of paper? If so, whose area would you use? Explain why. B. What is the area of the piece of paper? Explain your strategy for finding the area. C. Jasmine thinks she can skip count by sixes to find the area of her rectangle. Is she correct? Explain why or why not. 2. Jaheem says you can create three rectangles with different side lengths using 12 unit squares. Use pictures, numbers, and words to show what Jaheem is saying. 3. The area of a rectangle is 72 square units. One side has a length of 9 units. What is the other side length? Explain how you know using pictures, equations, and words. Four. Jack started to draw a grid inside the rectangle to find its area. A. Use a straight edge to complete the drawing of the grid. B. Write a skip count sequence you could use to find the area. C. Write a multiplication equation that you could use to find the area and then solve. <clears throat> Five. Half of the rectangle below has been tiled with unit squares. How many more unit squares are needed to fill the rest of the rectangle? What is the total area of the large rectangle? Explain how you found the area. I am now going to read the star questions attached to the mid-module. Number one, Mr. Johnson hired a contractor to replace the tile floor in his kitchen. He needs to determine how many square tiles to purchase. The contractor cleared the floor and made this diagram below. Read the statements below. Which statement correctly shows the number of tiles needed to replace the kitchen floor? A. He needs to buy 42 tiles because 6 times 7 equals 42. B. He needs to buy 36 tiles because 6 times 6 equals 36. C. He needs to buy 25 because 5 times 5 equals 25. D. He needs to buy 42 because 6 times 8 equals 42. Number 2. A rectangular note card is 4 inches tall and 6 inches wide. What is its area? A. 24 square inches. B. 20 square inches. C. 10 square inches. D. 2 square inches. Three. Kenzie wants to find the area of the shaded rectangle below. Which expression could she use to find the area of the rectangle in square units? A, 15 times 3. B, 15 plus 3. C, 15 times 3 plus 15 times 3. D, 15 plus 15 plus 3 plus 3. 